cool instrument. Right? But is it strong enough to illuminate the dark matter in the universe when I can't even find my keys? Anyway, I bought extras if you need. You never know. So, you're here. Still don't know why. Well, I'm glad anyway. I didn't tell Vivian. What's that about, do you think? I don't know. Yes, you do. It's possible not to know something. Well, I'm not going to press you for Einstein's equation or the history of the Crimean War. Though it wouldn't surprise me if you were on solid ground with Einstein and the Crimean War. It was the best of times, it was the worst of times. Dickens. I know the first line of pretty much like 100 novels. Science, not so much. When we say we don't know why we act a certain way, it's because we aren't looking in the right place for the answer, which is always there, lurking and avoiding us. What's kind of a bummer is things I'm usually open about, Vivian's pretty much not. So what's different about this? I didn't want her to think this was about her and me. Like, I was talking about our problems. We don't have any problems. Does she know about your parents separating? I was waiting to tell her until I knew if it was real or not. Hmm. What? I'm thinking about what you just said. So to shed some light? I mean, you've got a flashlight. <laughs> Tell me about Vivian. <laughs> I just love her so much. What just happened? I just wish we were already past this age. Because there's college and different people and things change. And I'm so sure of her right now. I don't want those other things to tempt us and take us away. Do you worry about that a lot? I don't like not knowing how it's all gonna turn out. Now I'm compelled by the playbook of my profession to say, nobody knows how it's all going to work out. I know it's hard. Did you always want to have a baby? And I can see our time is not up. <laughs> Why do you ask? I don't know. Really? Do you believe this? Jonathan's coach just called me into his office. I'm supposed to be the reason that Jonathan's screwing up. That's intense. <laughs> it bites. What am I supposed to do? So you're not getting back together? Jonathan thinks it was because he was pressuring me to have sex. I'm not this little virgin. I just didn't want to have sex with him. Wait, you're not this little virgin? How do you come off being mad at me for not telling you about Esther? Nobody knows, and I didn't tell you because, well, it was someone sort of older. Sort of older? It wasn't, you know, something wrong. It just wasn't exactly right. I don't feel like talking about it. That chick, you know she's hiding something. 
pool over there. Leading a double life. I'm telling you, man, everyone is completely not who you think they are. I'm still not seeing how you can turn this into something for the school paper, though. Comic strip. Hit me up. Okay. Everyone's got this other self. Like, there's this alternate universe of truth. And our characters, the fierce lesbian journalist and the black dude with super drawing powers, are the first inhabitants to actually live there. Gotta be a mission. They have to get people to live in their world, or it dies. Mm. Which is where the journalism comes in, because they have to uncover facts and expose people for who they really are. I know, coming from me. But it's all about taking people to a place where it's safe to be yourself. So it's got to be done mm -hmm. to save the world. Mrs. Winters thinks it's a cool idea. I'm going to do it, Arch. OK. I'll do the graphics, but you dig up the dirt. I don't need any more trouble in this school. <laughs> Awesomely dope. <laughs> Viv, I'm going to be out tonight, just so you know. Okay. Do you like this top? Because I'm having second thoughts. Hey, just want to let you know I'm not going to be around tonight. Probably back pretty late. Jacket or no jacket? You guys know you're being weird, right? I sort of have a date. You have a date? I have a date. Really? Yeah. I didn't think you knew anyone around here. I don't. It's a blind date. There's nothing wrong with a blind date. I have had blind dates. You could say I have one tonight. Someone please make it stop. We have the house to ourselves. How soon can you be here? You don't say hello first? Hello. I can't believe you didn't say anything. Why didn't you tell me you were seeing a shrink? I didn't want you to freak out. We're good, aren't we? See? <laughs> it's my parents, not us. So you don't talk about me? Fine. I don't want to invade your private secret place. Much too sacred. <laughs> Come on, baby, don't be like that. I'm just trying to figure some things out about myself. I will not ask what things. I will not ask what things. Hey, you know Sophie? She had a thing with an older guy. Yeah, so? It's just that she was so messed up when she found out about you and me. It's kind of interesting she never told me her little secret. I think she's crushing on you. Shut up. Maybe it's the other way around? No, really. Shut up.